Hello, welcome to A Closer Look. I'm your host, Linda Fontaine. Today, my special guest is Leslie Robertson. She is the founder of the Blessing Pantry Boutique. Thank you for being here today, Leslie. Thank you for having me. I'm so happy to be able to speak about this. Oh, good. Well, we're, we're, we're excited to have you here and learn about it. Yes. Tell me, what is the Blessing Pantry? Uh, so the Blessings Pantry Boutique is um, a retail store. It's a clothing store here out of Kingsport, Tennessee. Um, so we sell um, name brand items uh, from clothing to jewelry to makeup. Um, this is going to hold both men and women as well as children apparel. Very good. So how this come to be? Um, so, um, the Blessings Pantry Boutique is a venture of our nonprofit, Restoration Hope, um, and we wanted to do some good for the community um, with giving them a hand up rather than a hand out. And so, what our social <coughs> aspect of um, the Blessings Pantry is that we're able to give back to the community. Um, those that may be in need, um, we all know that COVID-19 has struck a lot of people. Um, a lot of people have been out of work. They don't have the financial means that they had previous to this uh, pandemic. Mm -hmm. So uh, the Blessings Pantry will suffice in some of those necessities that mm -hmm. Um, each family may have. So they're able to uh, fill out a voucher request, mm -hmm. just requesting things that they may need. Um, that could be apparel, that could be uh, toiletries, whether that is uh, deodorant, toothpaste, mm -hmm. toothbrushes, um, laundry care items, um, makeup. Let's say you don't have the means to have a nice outfit for a job interview that you may be coming into uh, within the near future. Mm -hmm. um, you can fill out that voucher, say my appointment is this date, I just need to get an outfit. You fill out that voucher, come to us, we'll give you the specific amount or designated amount on your voucher. Mm -hmm. You can shop in the store and then that outfit is yours to keep. Nice. Yep. Well, how do you get a voucher? Who do you go to to get the voucher? Uh, good question. So our vouchers are available online. Okay. Um, you can go to our website at restorationhope.net and um, there's a link on there for the vouchers. Okay. Or you can actually go to our store location and get a paper form to fill out there and um, get the voucher. So. Okay. Now what do you have to do? Do you have to prove like income, things like this? Um, you do. So the unique thing about our vouchers is um, you do have to have, of course, a valid ID. Um, we do keep on file how many times you, you are requesting um, okay. assistance, should I say. Um, and then you have to have a financial income statement, whether that is a pay stub, whether that is a unemployment um, form that you can get from DHS. Um, just something showing that you don't have the income or the um, finances to sponsor these items that you're getting for free. All right. Now, so someone gets a voucher and then they can come to y'all. Where do you get your items? You said retail store. So are these um, things that people donate or are these brand new items? How does that work? Um, so we are actually partnered with a lot of uh, local, um, national, and even international brands. Um, they will provide us their um, surplus or oh. maybe things that they've created that's a sample and then it, it didn't oh. go so well. Um, or what we like to call those items that um, aren't quite up to par with the um, requirements of that brand. So like would, seconds or something? Or? Well, like they have a, a wrong stitch. Yeah. And so, you know, if it's Levi, well, Levi has to be a perfect right. stitch. So that extra stitch, they're not going to just um, stop the whole production. So yeah. they would just give that to us. The imperfects. Yes. There you go. Yes, ma'am. Yes, the imperfects. Just like all of us. So, you know, <laughs> we can, 
you know, relate to these items, yes. so to speak, if we want to look at it that way. <laughs> so that's neat. So these are new items. They are. Yes, ma'am. Okay, very good. We used to have a store like that when I lived in Omaha, and it was all imperfect. And boy, that was a popular store because it's like you can't even tell. Right. Exactly. Most stuff you couldn't tell at all, and you'd get it half price. Right. So it's... we loved it. It was called the half price store. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, but this is the Blessings Pantry Boutique yes. in Restoration Hope. So where are you guys located? Um, we are located off of Fort Henry Drive, so our, our address is 2038 uh, Fort Henry Drive. We always say the old Papa John's because everybody remember oh, where Papa John's was. Yep, that helps. <laughs> yes. mm -hmm. The old Papa John's store. Yes. Oh, I remember that. I forgot that that was even there. <laughs> so that's great. 2038 Fort Henry Drive here in Kingsport. And what are your hours? Um, our hours actually do vary um, okay. per day. So we are closed on Sunday altogether. Mm -hmm. um, Monday and Tuesday we're open from nine to five. Mm -hmm. Wednesdays we're open from nine to three. Okay. <laughs> um, and that's just because we have church on Wednesday. Yeah. Um, Thursday and Friday we're open from nine to seven. Okay. And then Saturdays we're open from 12 to eight. Okay, and you can only shop there if you have a voucher. No, no, okay. actually this is for everyone. Oh, Anyone can come in I didn't know this. and okay. shop. Um, it's not just for those that have vouchers. We want the public oh. to come in and see what we have and um, find something for yourself. The vouchers are only for those that need that extra assistance. Okay. Oh, well, that's good to know. So yes. I could go shopping there if I want. Yes, yes, absolutely. Oh, boy, I like that. That's pretty good. Yes, ma'am. So the old Papa John's is now the Blessings Pantry Boutique. Yes. And so what do you do with the money? Um, we restore that money back into our Restoration Hope nonprofit um, because we do have other ventures that we are currently handling. So we just use that money to basically give back into the community through, through other projects. What are some of those projects? Um, well, we have one that we deal with youth, it's mm -hmm. called our Lunch Pad Program. Um, this is for our low income youth, our youth that are homeschooled that may not have the resources for art and things like that. Mm -hmm. um, and that will, we have four categories in that, in that uh, project for art, for music, for academics and environment. So they're able to come through an after school program and learn about these different things. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yes, ma'am. So you have several of those different kinds of organizations that the money goes to from people buying stuff at the Blessings Pantry. Yes, ma'am. I love that. And again, this is for anyone. Yes. Let's see, and I didn't pick up on that before. So I thought you just had to have a voucher. But if you can't afford things, you can go on the website, restorationhope.net, yes. and apply for a voucher for people yes. that have certain financial needs and can't afford to buy new items. I think that is a great idea. I think that's fantastic. Yes. And just follow the prompts on what you need to do to, to get the voucher right there. Correct, yes ma'am. All right, and this is open now? Uh, we're actually having a grand opening on February the 14th, which okay. is Valentine's Day. Oh, Monday. Yes, and it's gonna be at 12 p.m. So if you would like to come down at 12, it will be our, our grand opening. Come um, experience our grand opening with us and then just check out what we have in the shop and see what's available to you. Oh, that's perfect yes. because this is a blessing and Valentine's Day is all about love, <laughs> you know? Yes. So think about others in our community and come and help support the needs. I yes. love that. So again, this is 2038 Fort Henry Drive in Kingsport, the yes. Blessings Pantry Boutique and Restoration. Is there um, any volunteers you need? Is there something that the community can do for you above and beyond just shopping there? Or how's this work? Um, we... We don't really need volunteers okay. at this location um, right at the moment because we're just starting out, so sure. we're, we're staffed at the moment. But um, if the community would want to help, I mean, like I stated, this is a venture of Restoration Hope. Okay. So we are always looking for uh, monetary donations for Restoration Hope. Okay. Um, if you do wanna um, donate, um, 
we are always looking for toiletry items, laundry items. You can drop those off right at the store. Oh, that's nice to And know. we'll put it in stock for those that are in need. They, we would have that available. So um, we, we're not looking for any apparel at this time, okay. but um, like I said, the toiletry items, the laundry care, or even baby care. So oh, diapers, yeah. if you want to drop off diapers to us, we would certainly take those and give that back to those that may be in need. I love that. So this is like um, a win-win. You get to go shopping there and you get to donate something that could help others. So you yes. get some nice things to wear or to, to whatever you have to shop there. And you're helping somebody else in need by donating something. Yes. I love that. Again, this is the Blessings Pantry Boutique and it's at 2038 Fort Henry Drive. It opens Monday, February 14th. The hours will be nine to five on Monday and your grand opening will be at noon. At noon, yes ma'am. I love that. Thank you so much for being here, Leslie, and teaching us about the Blessings Pantry. Thank I hope you, you come back and we'll talk about this some more and see how things have been going once you've been open for a little while. Yes, well thank you for having us and let me give my spill about our retail store and I hope you all come and check us out. Oh, we will. <laughs> thank you, Leslie. This is a closer look.